People, people. Have you heard the good news? There's people. People that are making videos for you. Welcome back. That was a reference to a song, by the way. Welcome back to uh, Oblivion Permadeath um, episode something. Uh, I say episode something every episode. Reason being, I genuinely don't know where the episodes are at with most of my series. Is. Um, sorry, because the first time I said... What do you want? What do you mean, what do you want? You just... Freak. Yeah, anyway, the, the first time I said episode was something, it was kind of a joke, but I say it basically every episode now, because it's not a joke, like, I genuinely don't know what episode it is, and I find it easier just to say episode something. Back to episode... It's not, I've already said this, I think... This is episode 12. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to speak to Captain Bird, because I realise I haven't spoken, him, spoken to him since we found out she has a visitor. Yeah, who's that? What seems to... Nobody interested. Okay, where is what he? Third. I trust. No, we got nothing from that. Because I did actually look up on the internet what to do here, and I couldn't find anything other than to talk to Bird. Because like there are different outcomes for this mission based on like whether you'll dies or not, whether you find out about this visitor before or after you kill girl. There's loads of, like different outcomes for it, and. I couldn't find the answer to my outcome. So I actually don't really know what to do here. Let me check Yule's house one more time, just in case the visitor has happened to pop in whilst I've been out. No. Okay then. I guess I will be right back. Oh, the internet. Gamefax has told me the spy should be in this house or in the caverns is what the spy said. Once you've spoken to Bird and once you've spoken to the beggar, the spy should be in here somewhere. So I'm going to look in here. Someone said detects life is good. I'm pretty sure I don't have that on me. I guess I could buy that if I really can't find him. But he should be in here. This leads to the mountains. I guess I'll come round and try going right. But like, basically, everyone has just said that the spy should be somewhere around here. Because a couple of people said the spy will be waiting in the house. A couple of people said the spy is in the caverns. The the visitor spy is what I'm talking about here. But like, there've been no other. Ver there've been variations. Like, like I said, some people say it's in the house. Some people say it's in the cabins. But that's it. Like, no one said it'll be anywhere else. So in theory, I should be able to find the spy in here at some point. Oh, some people said in the basement, and some as well, and some people said in the house. So I guess I'll just can't wait while trespassing. Wait a couple times. I don't know if two hours will actually make a difference. But the internet sh said that the other spy should literally just be in this house or in the caves or something. Okay. Okay, so I'm back. Now, apparently. After a lot of internet scouring, this is actually a bug. Um, sometimes, if you kill Yurl um, alone, the the next spy just won't spawn, which is Severi Faram. Just won't spawn, like, ever. So it's a bit of a soft lock, pretty much. Um, but basically, everyone said that she'll either be in the basement of the house or in the caves. And I've waited a few times and checked both every time and can't find her anywhere. So basically, what I had to do to get rid of the bug was uh, hit Prid and then um, Severi Farum's uh, ID, which is 0003628787. That selected uh, Severi Farum, and then I just hit kill. So I had to do that in the console, which was a bit of a butt, but I got a bug, so there was literally nothing I could do about that, which is annoying, but hey. The Big Zone agent is dead. I should report to Joffrey. Both of, so yeah, so both of the spies are dead now. Um, it sucks that I had to use the console commands, but there was literally no other way out of that. Because, like I said, it's a bug, so she just, like, would never... Well, I say he, I don't know. Uh, it crashed. Brilliant. 
Okay, hopefully he doesn't crash this time. I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, I'm not surprised about that crash because I just did like some funky console command stuff. Okay, we're, we're good, good. Yeah, I mean that kind of sucks, but the, I mean there's nothing I could do about that. Um, fortunately, we have the console commands. I don't know what you'd do if you were on like an actual console, though. Like, yeah. I'm pretty sure there's no way to get around that. What have you learned? Excellent. They're both work. dead. You could come out on me, because I have the power of the console. So this guy's been studying the book, even though he's reading a different book now. Okay, Blood of the Daedra, that's the next quest. Um, hold on, let me just alt out, because I don't have Audacity open, okay. Audacity tells me how long I've been recording. So I use that. Well, OBS does as well, but I use Audacity. Okay. So, I should read... Fucking hell, this is a lot of text. You know, just like, modern, modern artifacts... For more information about how to locate Daedric Artifact, I need to look at Daedric Artifact and bring it back to Martin. Okay, so modern artifacts. Modern heretics. Modern he oh, modern heretics. I completely misread that. Um, the book Modern Heretics describes the location of the Shrine of Azura. Perhaps if I visit the shrine, I can learn how to obtain it. Okay. So I'm looking for the Shrine of Azura then, which I'm assuming will be on the map. Somewhere. Shrine of Azura. Please be on here. I'm going to have to find it myself. A strange door. Oh, that's DLC. Ah, oh, I have to find it myself, really. Fallen Rock Cave. That's butts. Dude, I'm <laughs> sick of cutting. No. There it is. Okay. It's hard to find. So I guess travel to Lake Arius, yeah, that's definitely closest. And I will take Tawny with me this time. Let's go, even though he sucks to ride. So I usually find the third person's better for riding horses. I can't... Right, turn. Yo, dude, this animation is dope. Right, where are we going? This way. Uh, he's stuck in a rock. He's literally stuck in a fucking rock. I don't remember it being this terrible. Okay, here we go. Right, I'll just see how far I can actually get on the horse, but I might end up jumping chip. I might not be able to climb this mountain anyway. Actually, I might not be able to climb it, period, let alone on the horse. That'd suck. Dude, if this was, if this was Skyrim with its realistic physics, I'd be able to climb this no problem. by glitching into the mountain a few times. Oh, I can still make this. This doesn't look that steep. Having said that, it's like completely flat, so in real life, it's like you'd have no footing on this. Right, this bit's a bit flat, so let's see if I can like... There's a mine up here. If I can just get to that, I can like fast travel to it and I'll be at the top. You can climb this. For sure. Yeah, we in there. Oh, if I can get to that grass. Grass is usually like a good place in video games. If you see grass, then you know you can climb up that bit. Okay, there's definitely not this sprint in this game, is there? I was trying to get to that camp over to the left as well. Because that, that might have some people. Oh, the song I was referencing at the start of the video, by the way, was People by A Wall Nation. <laughs> in case you were wondering. I'm kind of enjoying the weird intros and stuff. People, people, have you heard the good news? There's people, people making videos for you. It rhymed and everything, so that was pretty good. Even though the vast majority of these weird intros are pretty much just for my own weirdness. Because I'm pretty sure people are just going to listen to the intros and be like, I don't know what the fuck that was, let's just move on. Gutted mine. Oh, <laughs> gutted. Devastated, man. Devastated mine. Where am I going? I've gone way off track, but at least I've got like a good vantage point here. Okay, it's appeared on my minimap. Now, this doesn't look like something I want to be going down a horse on, so I'm going to get off. What? You, you just took damage from that? Okay. I have my sword out just in case we get like ambushed or some shit. 
Oh, there might be trolls around here. That'd be bad. As long as Tony's safe. No one should attack Tony now. He's gone. Okay. Oh, dears. I sniped today once. Like, back when I was first playing this game. Uh, I actually played it at a friend's house when I was, like, 10 or something. It was ages ago. And I was like, I saw a deer and I was like, oh, I'm going to shoot that. And he was like, there is no way you'll hit that. I fucking sniped it from, like, across a river. Some distance on it, too. Right, these guys... These are dark. John of Azura. We watch and this place is. I'm trying to con. You have that guy has more information for me. What? Ah, uh, I dropped some money. Something. This is the shrine of us. I wish you someone to I wish to speak to them. Leave her an offering of glow dust. And I need to find some glow dust. <laughs> um, let me quick save here. I don't know the quick save button. What did I put it as? Okay, whatever. Oh, they're fighting it too. Yeah, take. Whoa. Is he no, he's not dead. He's important. Can I hit it? Attack has no effect. That will, though. Oh, nice. I wrecked it. Where's it going? No, come back. I need your stuff. Glow dust. Okay, that's pretty easy. Why is it rolling down the hill? That's kind of funny. Did anyone else die? Hopefully he's out. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's awake again. You're really asking me again? Those guys didn't help. Those guys can die, though. They're mortal. Puny mortals. <laughs> Nothing happens. How interesting. So, it said dawn or dusk. Enemies nearby. Are you taking a piss? There we go. Right, I think we missed dawn. So let's do like six hours. Ten, ten hours. Why am I saying six when it's clearly ten? This might take me to dawn, or at least uh, to dusk even, or at least close to it. You wish off with glow dust to Azora. Yes. Yo, dude, chill. Five followers slew the vampire Dratic and its kin, but all are infected by the foul creature. Jamal. Knowing their fate, they sealed themselves up in the vampire's lair. Their suffering weighs heavily on me. Travel to the gutted mine. The door will open to you. Bring the peace of death to my followers, and you shall earn my gratitude. Um, trap themselves in the good mine. Find them and kill them, releasing from their vampiric existence. That's a different quest, though. I guess I need to do this to do the next one. The location. Yeah, okay, I guess I need to do this first, then. Okay, so where was the mine? It was, like, up here, wasn't it? Yeah, okay, we found it. Okay, that's. I'm glad I found it then. That actually saved me some time. Convenient. Stay, don't kill yourself. Let's go. So we're going to get some vampires, which is probably going to be hard. So let's just get a heal on. I should buy a better heal spell. Now I have a bit more health. Get in mind, this isn't as hard as I thought it would be. Afflicted brethren. And I'm going to be able to take like none of their stuff. Vampire dust is worth 50 though, and it only weighs 0.2. That's pretty good. Right, there are three of them. No, f five of them. Fucking hell. Sorry, I kind of shouted into the mic there. So there's four more. Silver vein. Oh, this game didn't have mining, does it? Oh, does it? I don't know. Please don't be invisible. It's kind of awkward. Oh, you were pretty easy. I'm going to take all this vampire dust, because all of them are only going to add up to one weight. Or like 250 gold. So I could probably get like 100 gold from it if I sell it all. Dude, please, I want the armor. Steel? Yes. I'm gonna have to drop some serious stuff here though. Oh never mind. I need like one more weight to drop. I have two of these. Yo dude, that steel is mine for show. Kvatch Curus is two. It's probably a bit broken. Five, dude. 
Yo, I am looking suave. That is... Dude, look at that armor. Let's kill some, some other truckers. Did you have anything else interesting? I didn't really check. <laughs> Just my crap, okay. This is a dead end. We are looking good. I love, like, the, the shoulder things. Like, stick up on the shoulders. I don't like how one... Why is one longer than the other? Either way, that is badass. It's not as good as um, Hieronymus Lex's, because that's got, like, gold rims and stuff. Which is awesome. Is this a bed? Oh, it's a coffee. new Blacksmith's pants. Someone is... Where are you? Someone's trying to kill me, but I can't see him. Do you mean take that? I don't know where you are. Someone's fighting someone. This place is so confusing. Oh, they're on the other side of this. Are they trying to hit me from the other side of the rock? Here we go. Yeah, let's get this over with. Oh, pfft. Just run away. Oh, you're an archer and a mage. The ultimate pussy. Alright, we're going this way then. This one's probably going to be a bit hard. It's probably like the Grand Master. Vampire. With cool armor? I can't really tell. Yeah, dude, that has a lot of health. Jesus, that was a massive step up. Oh, I'm not going to come I'm just going to put some some uh, weaponry inside of this vein. Right, let's just look at everything and see what I... Still have the silver dagger. Oh, there we go. That weighed more than I thought. There's a silver dagger inside of that. Dude, imagine that. There's a silver dagger in the vein. Someone just comes mining and finds, like, a dagger. Like, well, I mean, silver, so I'm taking it right. Oh, I thought he was stuck there, then. I was like, dude, this is going to be hype. Easy to kill. At least he has, like, a crappy weapon. Yeah, he's, like, barely even hitting me. Okay. Um, oh, no, it was just iron, okay. One faded note. See what that has to say. Oh, it's gonna have interesting stuff for finding the thing that I'm looking for. One faded note. Okay. This one faded note is written on a scrap of parchment secured by a piece of raw hide to the vampire's neck. Yo. My companion's names. Okay, names. The vampire died by our hands, but the price was dear. Those into whose hands we have fallen, we thank you and pray your favour. Oh, he's thanking us for killing him. We serve Lady Azura, bring these last words to her shrine. We praise her with the full fountain of our devotion. Our destinies have reigned in the stars. Why were there more of them that got turned into vampires than there were at the actual shrine? I've killed the vampires and I should return to the shrine, okay. We can find the exit. Okay. There's a little bit there that I haven't actually explored, but I can't be bothered. Because I'm not, like, looking for loot or anything. I'm just trying to finish the game. Like, I'm happy with what I've got. I like this weapon, and then this armor looks badass. Once I find an armor that looks badass and is pretty good, like, I am not going to change that until I get one that, like, looks more badass. I have no reason to be annoyed. <laughs> Dope-ass armor. That was pretty much with the Kavach Kura, so I was like, yo, this looks good. Chill. I just... A gate opened up? Tony, I don't... Yo, a gate's opened up. We are out of here, Tony. I'm not leaving Tony here. We're going straight back to the, the cave thing, the shrine. We are out. This episode's coming to a close. I don't know how long I spent... Cut, though. Dude... You can just go left and right, that's so much easier. Can you do this on console? I know it'd be different, because with the controller, the analog sticks are different. This is actually so much easier. You can just, like, tap left and right. Why have I been, like, trying to use the camera the whole time? Oh, will wisps Hopefully it won't attack me. No, it's fine. Tony, stay there. You that. There's another one. Really, you're having that much trouble with this? What is your wish? You. 
Your skin is tinted around the edge. Okay, Shrine of Azura. Their spirits are free, and henceforth above my shrine, five bright candles shall burn forever in memory. Yeah, I was going to say, really, there before. For your service, take this token that your deeds might be entered in the Book of Fate. Azura's star added. Azura thanks me for following her f for allowing her followers the piece of death. She rewarded me with Azura's star. I have the Daedric artifacts. Okay, so I'm going back then, right? Why is there like eight Oblivion gates opening up all of a sudden around here? By eight, I mean two. I wonder why the sky was still red. Cause oh, it's not anymore. Oh, I see the five. Five candles. Yeah, what is? That's two more gates I've opened up. Gates spooked me out, man. Okay. Yeah, I used to be terrified of gates when I got in the first place. I just ran away from them all the time. Like, so fast. Okay, let's talk to Boris. Because I don't like starting episodes with, like, the boring stuff, which is, like, talking to Boris. Okay, I think he's safe. I feel like a gate is going to, like, open up in the middle of this or something. Yeah, I, I should point out, I never actually really did that much of the main quest for Oblivion, like, at all. So I'm like way past where I got up to. Like I never got past. I think the farthest I got was the bit where. Are these all katanas? I never noticed these before. What a waste of weaponry. Yeah, the farthest I got was the bit where the Mythic Dawn attacked the, the, jo the Joffrey's. No, uh, yeah, Joffrey. They attacked Joffrey's Wayne and Priory. That's what it's called. Come on, what it's called. Ask what you went through to obtain this, my friend. Are you? You should talk to Joffrey. Trouble down in Bruma. Okay, so we're gonna wrap this episode of here. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like. If you love it, be sure to leave a favorite. I'm really enjoying Oblivion at the moment. Like, I'm about five episodes ahead pre recorded, and I really just wanna make another one. So I'm probably gonna go have something to eat and then make more. But I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like. If you loved it, be sure to leave a favorite. My name's Yay. I am gonna go, and I will see you guys in the next episode.